Welcome to CVC Plus series. In this video, I will show you how to set call forwarding and how can you use it. This feature has many possibilities. It comes very well and in hand with your profiles because sometimes you don't want to be disturbed, so you will want to redirect your calls, for example, to your secretary or to your voicemail. And I will show you how to do that. of Speed One Control Plus aren't just about the changing the volume. Definitely not. It has a lot more inside of it. And one of these features is call forwarding. It's very handy when you need to redirect the calls to your voicemail or to your secretary or someone else. You can imagine the situation, for example, when you are traveling and you cannot answer the calls about some project. So you can redirect these calls to your secretary or to your co-worker. And how to do it? I will show you it right now. I just need to tell you that this whole call forwarding feature depends on your career if your career supports it. You know, so just check that and make sure that your career supports call forwarding. And when you are ready, you can go to profiles panel choose any of these profiles or the default one but let's say that we want to set call forwarding only for silent you know when you set profile called silent for example in the evening or something like that all the calls will be redirect to someone else or to your voicemail it depends on your settings okay I will show you how to set it so it will be redirect to different mobile number. Let's scroll down. All these features are covered in our another video and this is it. Call forwarding. Click on it and click on turn on. Click OK. And now just write the number of the person or just simply choose from your contacts. This is very convenient way. Now click apply and it will set the call forwarding automatically you know registration was successful before I will show you how this works let's go to settings and I will show you a few options that are available there let's scroll down and here you have it call forwarding the first one is clear you have to enable call forwarding if you want to use it then we have forwarding code uh, the default one is 21 and the default settings should work in your country okay with all GSM networks but as I said it all depends on your carrier support so if you have different forwarding now code you can edit in here of course you can use only one format again it depends on your on your settings what default is unchecked unchecked box and you can even enable different disabling code and put it in here. In default, these settings works. You can also add a widget for it. So go to your widget list and find this one, call forwarding, add it to your screen, anywhere you like, and you can disable it or enable it. Please check the video just about widgets if we want to know everything about it and how can it be useful for you to have widgets on your screen and control the CVC plus from your main screen so we have just added this small widget there is a bigger one in the list but this is enough so we have enabled the call forwarding and now I will show you how this really works so let's say this is someone who is calling you okay and of course this is this is your mobile phone and you are having a good dinner with a beautiful girl and you don't want to be disturbed so you said that all the calls will be redirect to your secretary and this is your secretary mobile phone and this is the magic so person A is calling you and we will just wait a few seconds 
so the call is redirect and this is it so basically person A was calling you but you don't want to be disturbed so it was redirect to your secretary or it can be of course to your voicemail and your secretary answered the phone and you are completely free so this is how call forwarding works and I'm sure that it will be useful for you in many situations so don't be afraid to use it and if you want to see other videos about Smart One Control Plus please refer to our website thanks for watching